Renate Stumpf, a young German woman, faced a challenging start in life due to financial constraints that prevented her from pursuing a college education. Determined to support her family, Renate secured a job at a German army base in the late 1950s. However, her life took an unexpected turn when she crossed paths with an American soldier who would change her life forever. Working in the army base kitchen, Renette's culinary skills caught the eye of a young soldier named Louis Demetriades. Louis, stationed at the same base as Renette, was captivated by her cooking and her charm. Their shared age of 18 fostered a deep connection between them, leading to a blossoming romance. It was a simple request for a burger that marked the beginning of their love story. The first time I ever saw him, he asked me if I could fix him a hamburger. He liked who he saw, so he asked to go help me out in the kitchen. Renette recounted to ABC News. Their relationship quickly flourished, culminating in marriage. However, their happiness was soon challenged when Louis received an irresistible job offer in the United States, a proposition he couldn't ignore. Following their move to the United States, Renate and Louis embarked on building a life together and starting a family. Despite the love that continued to flourish between them, they encountered challenges that tested their relationship. While they adapted fairly well to life in America, Renate struggled with the language barrier, having never studied English. This difficulty in communication strained their relationship, leading to frequent arguments over minor issues. We had little financial support, I didn't know anything, and I could barely speak English, Renette candidly shared with ABC News. We started arguing about every little thing. Eventually, after years of grappling with these challenges, Louis and Renette made the difficult decision to divorce. Though painful, they recognized it as the best course of action for both of them. In the aftermath of their divorce, Louis moved to Memphis, Tennessee, and remarried, while Renate found happiness with a new husband. Despite sharing children, Renate and Louis drifted apart, with no communication between them for over 40 years. However, Louis harbored unresolved feelings for his former flame, prompting him to seek closure. One ordinary workday, Renate found herself speaking to a customer when she sensed someone behind her. Renate turned slowly, her heart pounding as she laid eyes on Louis standing before her. Instant recognition flooded her, stirring a complex whirlwind of emotions. Surprise gave way to anger, then confusion, swiftly followed by curiosity. What could Louis possibly want after all these years? And how had he managed to find her? Unbeknownst to Renate, Louis had secretly reached out to her daughter on seeking to reconnect. Despite her daughter's warnings that Renate might not react well, she provided Louis with the information he needed. Renate, oblivious to these behind-the-scenes efforts, was taken aback when she turned and saw Louis, causing her to tremble with a mix of emotions. Initially, Renate assumed it was one of her children coming to greet her, a common occurrence while she was at work. However, upon realizing it was her long-lost ex-husband standing there, she couldn't help but feel that her children and Louis had orchestrated this encounter. The sight of Louis, whom she hadn't seen in 43 years, left Renat in disbelief. What could he possibly want after all this time? Did she even want to see him? Her questions lingered until she noticed the sign he held in his hands, and suddenly, everything clicked into place. Louis had orchestrated the day to be more than just special. He had meticulously planned every detail. He had spoken with Renat's employer and colleagues, enlisting their help in his surprise. Additionally, he had arranged for one of Renat's daughters to capture the moment on camera. But Louis had one more surprise up his sleeve. Holding a sign, Louis greeted Renat with a playful, hey, good looking, before revealing the sign's message, happy Valentine's Day. However, the message didn't end there. As Renat read on, tears welled up in her eyes, at the bottom of the sign, Louis had written, Will you marry me? Overwhelmed with emotion, Renate embraced Louis, demonstrating that the love they once shared had never truly faded. Despite hoping for a positive response, Louis accepted Renate's playful rejection, followed by her heartfelt, Yes, but not today. 
Renate explained her decision, noting that after 43 years, she wanted to take some time to test the waters before committing to marriage again. The passing of their respective spouses had left them both single, but Renate and Louis understood the gravity of their decision. Their previous marriage had not stood the test of time, and they both wanted to ensure they were making the right choice this time around. Perhaps with the wisdom of age and experience, Renate and Louis could build a stronger relationship this time around. I will marry him though because he's a good man, Renate confessed. Reflecting on their tumultuous marriage, Renate wisely chose to proceed with caution, taking their reconciliation slowly. After 43 years apart, she hoped that they could reconcile their differences and build a stronger relationship together. But what motivated Louis to plan such an elaborate proposal? Louis wanted Renate to share in the joy of this moment with her friends and loved ones. Knowing Renate's sociable nature, he orchestrated the proposal to be a surprise not just for her, but for all those closest to her. He wanted to declare his enduring love for Renate amidst the company of the people she held dear. Explaining his choice of venue, Louis remarked in an interview, Why did I come to Walmart to propose to my wife again? It's because she has so many friends here, and I knew she would like to share that with them. It was a bold move to propose in such a public place, but Louis was willing to take the risk to make Renat's dream proposal a reality. The 75-year-old love story touched the hearts of many, leaving them enamored by the unexpected reunion and the enduring power of love. But what about Louis's surprise proposal? A mix of excitement and caution for the reunited couple. Some celebrated their reunion, highlighting the long-awaited realization of love's worth. It took him 43 years to figure out that he let a diamond go the first time around. Good for them. Others, however, advised Renat to proceed with caution, reminding her of the reasons behind their initial divorce. Remember why you divorced the first time. Caution take your time when making your decision. Despite the cautious voices, Renate remained steadfast in her decision. She was certain of her feelings and knew what she needed to do. Despite 43 years of separation and not knowing anything about each other, Renate and Louise rekindled their love, a bond that had never truly faded. Their encounter in December reaffirmed their deep-seated love, sparking a new chapter in their relationship. Now reunited, Renate and Louis were determined to make their relationship work. Renate, however, emphasized the importance of taking things slow. There's no rush at my age, she explained. God put us together again, and it couldn't be any other way after all these years. They were in no hurry to rush into marriage, opting instead to savor every moment together as a happy couple. Louis's bold and heartful proposal driving all the way from Tennessee to surprise Renate at work, showcased his unwavering love and determination. Despite the risks, he took a chance on love, demonstrating that true love knows no bounds and can withstand the test of time.